Hey guys, it's Dams with another video, and today we're going to be talking about our sits, Rainbow Sits Siege. And today we're going to talk about tips and tricks to help you get better at Rainbow Sits Siege at rank or casual, or you're just trying to get better with an operator. Alright, my first tip is to wear a headset and a mic. Talk to your team. I don't know how many times I died because someone on my team couldn't just say ash behind or thermite is going through that wall and wear a headset so you can hear your surroundings don't use the tv volume or your monitor volume or whatever you use don't use that use it a headset because it'll help you hear better and know where the enemy is coming from like footsteps to the left or someone's above you or you can hear breaching charges like far away okay my next tip is to Use ACOG on your gun. ACOG is a really good sight. But before you use it and go into a rank match, make sure to um, get to know what how it feels to have ACOG. Because ACOG zooms in a lot. But it's a really good sight. Really good. Okay. My third tip is to know the layout of the map. See right here? I shoot that camera because I know it's there. If you didn't know it was there, you might get cough off guard. Or get killed by a Valkyrie or something. So know the layout of the map. Know every breach point to the objective. Cameras. And like drone hiding spots and stuff. Okay my next tip. My fourth one is. To always. Always. Okay. Don't play like you're in Call of Duty. That's that's what I mean. Always take it slow. Never take it fast approach. And because you just get killed. When I first time I got this game, I tried to play it like Call of Duty and I lost. Big time. I lost 40 matches before I can realize how to play this game. Crazy, right? Okay, my last tip is... To always, always, always have a thermite or hambama on your team. Someone who can get through those reinforced walls. Because without that, you can still win the round and match and stuff. But you have a better chance of winning if you had them on your team. Wait, I have one more tip. I have one more tip. Extra one. Bonus. Alright. Always aim your gun where you think that you're going to get a headshot. Never aim your gun at the body. Unless it's like you're panicking and stuff. But that's not an excuse either. You should always aim your gun at the head or neck. Neck and up. Always aim, aim at the neck. Because I think from my past experience, it'll still count as a headshot. Aim at right at the neck. Because you get body shot or a head shot. I'm pretty sure you won't miss unless you have super bad aim. Okay, that's all my tips for today. If you enjoy, subscribe. And I'll leave you to the rest of this gameplay. I'm going to trim it down to 4 minutes. Oh, wait, 6 minutes. So, it, once you guys are hearing me right now, it's going, this is actually 8 minute gameplay. But I'm going to trim it down to 6. Peace. 5 seconds remaining. Did not secure the biohazard container in time. Mission failed. We need to protect the biohazard container. Secure the room. Take some trouble. Op 4 located the 
biohazard container. Ten seconds left. Down to five seconds. Protect the biohazard container at all costs. 